Hello everyone and welcome to our 1010x step-by-step -step video series. I am Augusto Marcones and I will show you how to get the fastest performance out of your Terminal 1010x. First thing, inside the box, each Terminal 1010x comes with a default configuration. In order for you to use that default configuration, the only thing you need is a router and a computer. So you can either test the analog ins and outs or start from that default configuration your own system. Let's do it. So the first thing is you connect your CAT5 to the Ethernet port on the rear panel of the Terminal 1010X. Then you connect to any available port on your router. The display will show you an available IP address that is now the address to access the default configuration inside the Terminal 1010X. The Ethernet communication will start flashing and we will type in exactly this IP address onto your web browser. Of course, the computer needs to be connected to the same network. In this case, I'm working wirelessly. So the good thing about this is that you can also access and control your Terminal 1010X from your smartphone, from your tablet, or any other device connected to the network. So once we type in the IP address here, it will show us the default configuration web remote page, where you can have your instructions, the admin menu, the user menu, or the option to log out. So the password for the administrator is 1234, 1234 and then you can access all the mono zones one to eight, the sources A, B, C, and D, which are respectively analog inputs one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven, eight, the volume of each zone, a three band parametric EQ, then you can go back to the administrator menu, stereo zone number nine, also the four sources for you to select from, back to the administrator menu, so the local mic, will allow you to do announcements over zones one to eight, and the master microphone will do announcements over all zones, and it's also priority on top of the local microphone. As you can see, the microphone control page allows you to add 48 volts, and then you can control the gain, also a three band EQ for you to use. With the administrator menu, you can mute and activate all the outputs at once, and maybe at the end of the day, you can press full reset to get back to the initial parameters. Then you can easily log out, bookmark the page for future accesses. It's very important to remember that all web browsers from a smartphone, from a tablet, from any portable device can access the web remote page for the default configuration of the Terminal 1010X. Very easy, isn't it? So, if you want to customize, if you want to create more pages, if you want to put the logo of your company, you can change all the colors, you will need to use Halogen. But this is a topic for our next video. Thank you very much for watching this 1010x step-by-step -step video series. See you next time. Bye-bye.